Hello friends, in this video we are going to study boundary layer thickness, what is meant by boundary layer thickness and derive displacement thickness. Boundary layer thickness is denoted by letter del. So it is a distance we know that velocity distribution surrounding a boundary say this is a boundary stationary boundary and this is flow surrounded by a boundary we call it as u letter u this is point a that is starting point that is leading edge and we know that at that point velocity is zero so if I want to talk about distribution of velocity, if along the y-axis u is plotted, then it is clear that curve will start from the zero and will go on increasing like this, parabolic in nature. This is parabolic curve. And a certain stage will reach such that its velocity will become 99% of u, 99% of stream velocity, free stream velocity. So, first of all, we will define boundary layer thickness. It is the distance from boundary to point where velocity of fluid is approximately equal to 99% of free stream velocity. We denote it by letter u. Free stream velocity is denoted by letter u and it is denoted by symbol this del. So here this distance is nothing but the day boundary layer thickness. We all know that for understanding various types of thicknesses which are going to be studied in further, let us assume that these are the layers, different layers having different velocities. I will name them as small a, small b, small c, small d and small a. It is clear that velocity of layer A is less than velocity of layer B. So it is clear that discharge which was occurred before placing this plate was reduced because velocities are reduced. So reduction in velocity corresponds to reduction in discharge, reduction in energies, reduction in momentum. So accordingly, we have to provide various concept that is displacement thickness momentum thickness and energy thickness Whenever we will define these three terms, I will compare the case of boundary with case when there is not a boundary. So whatever are the values when there is not boundary that are larger, that is displacement or momentum or energy is larger and these values are reduced due to presence of this boundary. 
so we are going to increase the thickness of a layer such that increased value of respective terms will be equal to the original value when there was not a boundary so the concept is very simple if i want to compensate discharge firstly discharge secondly momentum and thirdly energy with original values i have to increase the thickness of layer thickness of fluid and that increment is nothing but the displacement thickness momentum thickness and energy thicknesses so we will start with our first topic that is displacement thickness so it is a distance perpendicular to boundary this is the boundary and these perpendicular distances are displacement thickness so it is a distance perpendicular to boundary perpendicular to boundary by which boundary should be displaced outward to compensate for reduction in discharge it is a very important term this discharge i am going to define three terms in this term the important part is discharge we are going to compensate discharge and accordingly the thickness is increased in boundary layer layer formation so denoted by del star this del star is the symbol this del star is the symbol for displacement thickness and calculated as integration of zero to del 1 minus u upon capital u dy now we are going to study how it is calculated by using this equation so for that purpose we are going to solve with basic assumptions consider u equal to free stream velocity at distance y this is y there exists a elementary strip this is the elementary strip so u is velocity at elementary strip from y distance from boundary dy is thickness as this is the strip this thickness is dy so this distance which is shown in diagram is nothing but the dy thickness of strip so mass per second through strip 
basically derivation is the process in which we will consider a small strip we will form an equation which has been followed and we will integrate because derivation means making some smaller parts and integration means combining that smaller parts so by the process of integration we will combine the parts which are in smaller section and we have obtained some values corresponding to smaller sections so integration of that equation will be the final value that we want so final thickness can be calculated total thickness can be calculated by integration process and for integration process it is very important for us to formulate an equation formulate and relation regarding that thicknesses so mass per second through strip can be written as we all know rho into v into a this area into this velocity is nothing but the meter per second in longitudinal direction so cross sectional area multiplied by length becomes volume that volume multiplied by density becomes mass but velocity is having unit meter per second distance in one second so this mass becomes per second because we are considering this term velocity so it becomes rho v a but in our case area is cross sectional area which is rho into this velocity is u and area is this distance dy into b we all know that this dy multiplied by width of the section so this b is nothing but the width of the section so rho into u into b into dy mass per second through strip if no plate is placed we are going to see the difference with which when created due to presence of plate so for that purpose we have to know what will be the value when plate is absent obviously it will be greater value and we are interested in difference between them so i will find this mass per second through strip if no plate is placed at equal to rho into this u is reduced velocity now i will consider original velocity because no changes in velocity rho into capital u into b into dy so total reduction total reduction in mass per second is rho into u into b into dy minus rho into u into b into dy three terms are common capital u minus small u rho into p into dy but this reduction which we have obtained is for a particular small strip that we have considered now we will consider whole thickness that is from zero to del and integration of this equation so total reduction of mass per second for whole boundary layer is equal to integration from zero to del this capital u minus small u into rho into b into this 
dy. Let plate is displaced by delta star, del star. Now I am interested in calculation of del star. So for that purpose, I have to replace the plate. I have to displace the plate. Let that distance be delta star. So loss of mass per second flowing through distance del star is rho into velocity into area so rho into u into this distance b into del star so equating i will denote this equation as equation 1 this as equation 2 so equating equation 1 and 2 we have rho u b del star is equal to integral from 0 to del rho b capital U minus small u dy so del star is nothing but the 0 to del capital U minus small u upon capital U this is bracket into dy because this rho b are the constant terms these are get cancelled I can change this term and simplify it as 0 to del 1 minus small u upon capital U into dy. So displacement thickness can be calculated by integrating this equation. That's all. Thank you.